that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadows of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God, and Him will I trust. Thank you for hearing me at the beginning of your word. I like to pass the same. Thank you. All right, how's everybody doing? Good. Excited about our second service, amen. All the Spirit said is growing, amen. I'm not caught up in size and numbers, but I'm caught up in the evidence of the Holy Spirit and what God is doing in the lives of His people. Welcome, Periscope. This Pastor Sibby Goose, we the Father of God. This is like Outreach Ministries. We believe in winning souls for Christ, not being led by the ways of man, but by the Spirit of the living God. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome for our second service, our power press service. What we're going to do, we're going to begin to start praying. If y'all have any prayer requests, we're going to type it up, and I will catch it in the next replay of this broadcast. Or if you have anything privately that you don't want nobody to read publicly, email me at sibiagooski.gmail.com. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many y'all ready to get into the presence of the Lord? Amen. Amen. Y'all know right or wrong way to pray. As long as you open to the Lord in your heart spiritually and just begin to just start speaking to the Lord. Amen. Whatever it is, because God pretty much knows what we all need and what we're going through. But confession is good for the soul. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, we thank you, Father God, for allowing us to be here again in the name of Jesus. Allowing us to be here again. I say your services, Father God. We thank you, Father God, for the testimonies that's coming in. We thank you, Father God, for the stirring that you are doing right now in the name of Jesus. Father, we want to thank you, Lord, for the souls that sacrificed to come in here today to just worship your name and to pray to you, Father God, and not only pray to you, but to lift up everything that's on their hearts and on their minds and on their spirits unto you in the name of Jesus. Father, we want to thank you, Father God, because your presence is already here. Your presence is already here. And I hear the Spirit of the Lord say that he's going to shift. And his fire is going to come in the name of Jesus. His fire is going to come. In the name of Jesus. Lord, you are welcome to this place, Lord God. You know the needs that we have, Lord God. I ask you, Lord, in the name of Jesus, that you begin to have your way, Lord God. Have your way in this place, Lord God. Move ourselves out of the way, Father God, so we can get into your presence. Move ourselves out of the way, Lord God, so we can get into the presence. So we can get into the presence of your bosom. Forgive us of our sins and transgressions and anything that we might have done, Father God. That was not pleasing in your sight. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God, begin to stir and shift things in the spirit, Father God, so we can be the intercessory our prayer warriors that you want us to be, Father God. Teach us, help us, guide us, Father God, into all truth in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Help us in our families, Lord God. Help us in our homes, Father God. Help us in every situation, Father God, that we may have right now in this hour in the name of Jesus. If there's anyone on Periscope under the sound of my voice that don't have Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, Father, I pray that tonight they will receive you, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to your name. God said, just begin to start waving your hands. And just start worshiping him. If you don't have no point right now, it's okay. Just need to start worshiping him. Amen. Because what's blessing goes up. Was once we lift up the blessings that we're trying to get from God, blessings will come down. As we lift up the prayers before God, blessings will come down. Like I said yesterday, and I'm saying it again today. Closed mouth don't get fed. Closed mouth don't get fed. Amen. We got to begin to start worshiping the Lord. Start speaking to the Lord again to the presence of the Lord. Let your fire come 
Lord God. Let your fire come. 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 We thank you, Lord God. Hey, Shalom, I'll say. We thank you in the lands, Lord God. Hey, Shalom, I'll say. I hear the Spirit of the Lord say, just raise your hands, heaven of us, and begin to start giving it to Him. Begin to start worshiping Him. Oh, Shalom, I'll say, Shalom, I'll say. How bad do you need what you need from God? How bad do you need what you're asking for from God? How bad do you need it from God? How bad do you need it from God? How bad do you need it? Hey, Shalom, I'll say, Shalom, I'll say. Sometimes God will allow trials and tribulations and situations to get in your path to, to humble you and to allow you to surrender to him. So he began to come into your life and do what needs to be done. Amen. God did design us to be on our own. The Lord did design us to be on our own. The Lord designed us to be an instrument to him. God designed us to worship him. God designed us to give our all to him. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Lord God. We rebuke the spirit of distraction in this place in the name of Jesus. I don't know about y'all, but I need God to move. I need God to reign. I need God to do what needs to be done in my life in the name of Jesus. This is not for show. I hear the spirit of the Lord. This is not for show. Everything we do, we do it in peace and in order. And we do this because we need God to move on our behalf. In the name of Jesus. And I know that the natural mind don't understand the spiritual things of God. The natural mind is never going to understand the spiritual things of God. Because we have to be in the spirit to receive what God is trying to do. And what God is trying to deliver in the name of Jesus, Lord God. The Bible says that carnal mind is death. Carnal mind is death. Carnal mind is death. Amen. When you have a carnal mind say it won't stand on nothing. If you have a carnal mind say it don't stand on nothing. Amen. That's just like rocky ground, flaky ground. Amen. It's just like taking a taking a, 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 a seed. Amen. And throwing it into the ground and expecting a harvest. But you know when you have a carnal mind say there's no fruit in this. There's no deliverance that can come out of carnal mind. That's why the Bible says that this mind be in you which is also in Christ Jesus. That's what I'm going to say. God wants us our minds to stay on Him all the time. Amen. And I know in some days that we don't think about the Lord as much as we should because we caught up with the things of this world because we do think. Amen. That's when we need to just shift ourselves and turn ourselves into the presence of the Lord. And begin to be like, okay, God, what do you want me to do, Lord God? Because what I'm doing in the natural is not helping me. But if I tap into the spiritual things of God, I know that I will begin to reach life everlasting in the name of Jesus. Take us up, God. Take us up, God. Take us up, God. It's some things that God is trying to do. I keep hearing him say the fire's going to come. I'll show go shit here, shit on both seven. And I'm not picking up that type of fire in the form of judgment, but I'm I'm picking up consuming fire. Hey, go shit here, show go say the low both seven. That consuming fire. I shut up, oh, say the little oh, say. That's gonna drag on in and burn out everything that's not like God. Amen. So he can see his reflection. Amen. Off of us. So he can see his reflection off of us. Amen. So we can be in the newness of him. In the name of Jesus. In order to be in the newness of him. Amen. God got to do those things that need to be done. Break up that follow ground. Amen. Get that soil soft. Amen. So as we begin to start walking and planting seeds and serving God and doing what the Lord will have for us to do. Amen. According to his will. Amen. We're going to see a harvest. Amen. It ain't just about just getting blessings in the natural. Amen. But you want to have a good, firm foundation in the spirit. Amen. You want to have a good, firm foundation in the spirit. Amen. Because the spiritual life is life everlasting. The spiritual life is life everlasting. For those that seek him, I hear the spirit of the Lord. For those that seek him, he shall go, 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 he shall go
saying, God, I'm calling back. Hallelujah, the backslider, God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you today, God. Those that are out there that want to know who, who is it, who can they turn to, you can turn to God. He said, I'll never leave you, never forsake you, in the name of Jesus. When you feel like you can't see your way, God said, I will be the way. When you feel like you can't go on, begin to call the He'll turn it around. He'll fix it. Hallelujah. Even though you feel like taking that, that drug, God, we find that in the name of Jesus. God is the answer. God is the way. Don't try it. Let it down. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for finances today. Those that need it. Hallelujah. That you will begin. God, you said if we ask you in your name, it shall come forth. I pray for businesses, hallelujah. It's time for the people of God to be blessed, hallelujah. Not begging for bread. But God said, I'm going to turn the hearts of men back to God. And we just keep seeking him. And we keep searching for God. He said, I will do great and mighty things. I will restore back the years. I will restore back what the enemies took in the canker worm, the locust, the caterpillar have took in and eaten up. I want to give it back, says God. Yea, Lord. Yea, God, to eat it. I saw that. Lord, I thank you right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, there is a ship in here. There's a word that's being spoken. Have an ear to hear because God is speaking today. Good. Begin to praise him. Begin to seek him. God said, I'm going to do some things, but all you got to do is get your heart right in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you, God. Lord, I thank you, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. My soul says yes. My mind says yes. In the name of Jesus, have your way, God. Have your way, God. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Because God's going to 
you some for her here on Monday, and she needed a break. Hallelujah. Let's give God another hand of praise. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. If there's anybody on your Periscope that's in need of prayer, go ahead and email me at sylviagooseby.gmail.com. Amen. If you have any prayer requests, you can type it up, and I will pray over those prayer requests later, even though I've been praying for you guys uh, right now. So just begin to start typing up your prayer requests. All right, my daughter says someone had just got out of jail and that you need prayer. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, we pray for that individual that just got out of jail. Don't you know that Paul, he spent most of his time in jail, and God has given him a lot of revelation when he was in jail. Amen? And now that you're out of jail, begin to start seeking God where you are. Begin to start praying. Amen? Begin to start lifting those things, amen, that you need God to do. We come into agreement for you and believing with you that God is going to do what needs to be done in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, And Father, me being an angel of this house, Father God, I don't want to miss you. I don't want to miss your move. I don't want to miss you moving in the spirit. I want to catch everything that you want me to catch in the spirit. Concerning the souls that's coming in here. Amen. Because it ain't about me. I want to miss nothing. Amen. I don't want to miss nothing. I don't want nobody else in here that's going to miss anything. We want to receive everything that you allow for us to receive, Father God. In the name of Jesus and everyone that's on Periscope. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Before I close out, there's anyone that needs prayer, personal prayer, I will pray with you if you're looking for personal prayer. If you believe in God for something, or you want someone to stand into agreement, amen, we know at Sunday services the Lord had his way, and I see that the Lord is having his way again, but I hear that word breakthrough, not your breakthrough, Julia, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, we thank you, a lot of times we just got to press into praise, and press into praying, amen, because you never know what God is going to do for you out of your obedience, amen. My email address is sylviagoosbygmail.com for those that wants to email me. My email and my PayPal account is at the beginning of my profile page on Periscope. My um, PayPal account is paypal.me slash sylviagoosby for those that want to sow it to this ministry. Or you can email me at sylviagoosbygmail.com. I just want to say thank you guys for joining us in prayer. And we will see you again at Wednesday Night Bible Study. Be blessed.